I wanted to give, or, you know, have a little tribute to uh, Michael right now. Uh, you know, I was uh, fortunate enough to train with Michael quite a bit, and one, I wanted to tell a quick story. I don't want to take up too much time, but something that really stuck with me about what Michael did to me one time. Um, we were, he was doing a seminar in New York that some of us went to a few years ago, something like that, 10 years ago. Yeah, and one of my friends called me and he was doing like a little private get together at a school. So I, of course, said yes. And I went to that school. There was maybe 10 or 15 of us, very small. It was Daniel, Michael, and a bunch of really hardcore fighters. No, like it was a very small fighting school and they were all tough dudes. Michael was demonstrating punches and he called, you know, he wanted to demonstrate on my face. So we did this thing where he just stood there for a second and he was kind of invisible but strong punches that were soft. So he hit me, boom, right in the face and I'll never forget, I dropped and hit the floor and I was like, and I got hit straight on the chin. But the craziest thing was when he hit me, it felt like his fist, it felt like a brick wrapped in a pillow. So it's like the initial hit was very soft and then it was like, oh, I'm okay and then something else hit after. And I remember hitting the floor and I was just laying there like, what was that? And he comes over and he kicks me. So I stand back up and I'm like, what? And he just started laughing. I don't understand. I, I don't speak Russian, so I didn't understand what he was saying. But, and the room was kind of spinning. So he looks at me again. He picks his fist up like this and I'm in my head. I'm like, what is he about to do? And hits me again. Boom, right? Same spot, right on the chin. Sends me like right down to the floor. And I'll never forget. I was like, I'm making sounds. I was like, what was that about? And I'm rolling there, I'm just sitting there, my face is hurting, and all the other guys you hear like, whoa, right? Comes by, kicks me again. I was like, no, 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 please no. I got the lesson. So I stand up, and he starts, you know, looking at me like wondering, I guess he's wondering if I was okay. And uh, so I'm looking at him, and he picks up his hand like this. I was like, oh, you know, I'll just fall down. <laughs> like, <laughs> and he goes like this, he waves, and some, sometimes you'll see that in the video where he'll do this, and then he'll hit you. So he waves and I kind of expected it and he hit me again. This time I went flying back and I hit the floor and I'm laying there. And I can't even tell you, my, I was just like out of it. But I'll never forget because I was waiting and I was like, first thing I said in my head when I was laying down on that third punch was, I go, oh God, please not again. That's, that's what I said in my head. The rest of them were like, why did he do that? That really hurt. What am I learning? That third one I laid on the floor and I specifically said to myself, God, not again. And then I'm laying there, no kick. So I'm laying on the floor and I'm like, maybe I'm safe. So I look up and he goes like this and he goes, so I stand up and the translator says to me, how was your conversation? And I kind of like got the goosebumps because I was like, what do you mean? How was my conversation? Michael said, how was your conversation? I was like, I have no idea what you're talking about. And he goes, did you not ask God for help? And I was like, oh, no, how'd you know that? <laughs> and uh, it, I can't even explain to you, it blew my mind. Because, you know, I realized something that Michael, you know, we were talking about yesterday, what system is about, non-destruction, right? But I, I, what I experienced from Michael, and not to get into religion or spirituality, but I think what Michael was trying to do was to create a bond between God and man or God and person. And it was a very important lesson to me that day. I mean, it, it was just incredible for him to see how many times does it take for you to get hurt or get knocked down and before you start getting on your knees and asking for help. And I learned from that day, instead of getting so many punches or, or getting hurt so many times to actually ask for help before all that comes. And it makes a huge difference in my life. So that was like one of the most important lessons I ever learned in Sistema, for sure, from Michael. So I like sharing that with everybody, but just my story. Okay.